cover up. Uh, once the crime scene is stabilized, as has happened in the last few critical incidents, then that outside agency does begin their investigation. Uh, the problem with the uh, Department of Criminal Investigations, uh, not just the fact that retired officers from the region work there, that wasn't the only issue with DCI. Uh, the other issue with DCI is that they're spread all over the state, so their response was um, could be extremely taken a long time. Like one scene, it took DCI about two hours to get there to get an investigation, which is causing an uncomfortable situation for witnesses. But um, if, an, if an event happens in the city of Milwaukee, this task force would, um, of surrounding agencies uh, one of the other departments would end up being the lead agency, it would not be us. Right, and I understand that's what you're saying, but your protocol does not read that way, actually. And what it says is that the lead investigator plus one other person that's not part of the involved agency, which right. is what their law requires. So it does track that piece of the statute. Um, but other than that, it just says those two people cannot be part of the agency, but other staff that support in the is determined by the involved agency. And so that, that really doesn't make sense to me. Um, it just seems to me that there's a lot of times that I was reading and it just kept referring back, this is determined by the involved agency, or the involved agency has this discretion. And, and that doesn't make sense to me. So um, I did only have a very limited period of time to read it because I came when I had time. And so maybe if I had more time to review it more carefully, I, 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 I might think differently. But as of now, I, I, I was not very, uh, I don't see how this memorandum of understanding is going to make anything um, better than what the current um, procedure is. And I understand what you mentioned as far as possibly um, being able to in initiate the investigation more quickly because of DCI not being able to respond as, as, as quickly, but I don't know that that is something that would we should sacrifice the integrity of the investigation in order to arrive there sooner. Um, and the whole purpose of having this investigation is so that people understand and feel confident that the investigation is non-biased and objective. And, and if the investigating agency plays such a large role, I don't see how that's actually being satisfied. Mm -hmm. yeah.